second filming day. I haven't tried filming, I mean, I never filmed the vlog. This will be my first attempt. Today, I finally don't have any online class. So my plan is to study until lunchtime. I had to write five mini things on different topics in Korean, around 150, 200 words and then send to my professor and she needs to correct them and give me feedback about them. In the meantime, I am also... <laughs> Do you want to hear a fun story? I have my dissertation due it to June and last Saturday I sent my project to my tutor. Until now, she hasn't replied yet. She hasn't given me any feedback. I was thinking, okay, maybe she's busy. You know, it's graduation time. She is maybe correcting something else, a lot of project. And <laughs> oh boy, I was very optimistic. And I forgot what my university is famous for, being a mess. For once, I went to the Facebook group of my university and there was a girl who said that the server was down for the whole weekend, so every email sent was not delivered, and so we had to send the email again. So yesterday, <laughs> I sent the email again. At first, I wanted to wait more, because, I mean, I didn't know if my mail was actually not delivered, or if she's really busy, so she had an, enough time to check my project. But I said, Whatever, I could be waiting for one week without knowing my destiny and I don't want to, so just to be clear. Also, she's very easygoing, so she definitely won't think bad about me or maybe that's just what I want, what I want to think she thinks about me. I don't know, I'm just waiting for now. So I'm waiting for my project to be approved. I asked for a feedback and hopefully, hopefully she won't say with nice words that this if she gives me her approval, thumbs up. In order to be able to graduate by the end of July, I had to send my dissertation one month earlier. That's it. <laughs> so let's hope she likes my project and so I can work on it. If she says yes, I know what I have to do. But if she says something different, I have to figure out what to do, which is giving me anxiety. Actually, I'm studying because I don't want to think about my dissertation. It's kind of productive, you know? Now I think I talked too much and I should actually get something done. See you later. Let's do this. Also a big filming day because I have been uninspired for the last few days and then yesterday all at once inspiration hit me finally finally this brain started to work again maybe I don't know because I was studying so I kept on my brain working I had to film this vlog which is my first attempt to vlogging then I want to film other two projects one it's a very mini project and the other one it's a legit video I mean I have something to say <laughs> basically yeah let's do this
not in vlogging mode anymore so I did everything I planned to I cannot believe I filmed my three videos I mean, this is part of the third one, but still, almost finished. My tutor still didn't answer. Now it's 7 p.m. and she didn't give me any feedback. So we're still waiting, we're still waiting. Gotta be patient or trust the universe. One day, this week, I will get the feedback anyway. So yeah, that's it. First, I think I'm gonna take my makeup off, have dinner, and yeah, see you soon. I hope you had a proactive day too. And yeah, I don't really have those kind of days. I mean, this is not my typical day, even though it would be called maybe daily vlog. There is nothing daily about this routine. I mean, my routine is always the same, like breakfast, coffee, yoga, yes. But I don't film three video every day or anytime I think I want to and most importantly I don't study as much as I want to every time so keep that in mind you I mean you gotta get balance you need to have days where you feel better days where you just feel awful and that's okay and I mean that's life I guess now that the sun is setting wait hold I think I'm gonna have dinner and now that my creativity is back to normal I am again with my thoughts I don't know about what to do after all of this I mean I should be graduating in July and I, I probably told this this morning I don't remember but I say I should because I have no idea if they are going to delay or just in general but yeah i think i never told on the internet i mean it was basically my first video on youtube where i said that i really wanted to move abroad did i say that uh, well if not i say it now so my plan is to graduate as soon as possible i mean the, as soon as possible should be in july and i want to move abroad mm, but i'm re i really don't know i mean i, I mean I, I know i want to move abroad but i don't know where exactly because the easiest easiest part would be moving somewhere in europe because i don't need any visa so i can not plan because the thing is i was debating whether going back to japan or america <laughs> i mean not back to america because i've never been there. but i know that at some point in my life i want to live in the us i don't know where but I'm pretty sure when I, I want to do that experience and the problem is visa it is just real life I mean this is my m main concern right now because in Europe I would like to move either London or in Paris and even with Brexit I think I mean I checked the government website coming from the EU shouldn't be as hard as getting a regular visa unless they change something else in the next few months but yeah i really don't know <laughs> i mean i know i want to move i don't know where so i have this idea broad idea i'm not sure about whether i can make it happen or i mean i'm sure i can make it happen wait 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 wait, wait a sec i know i can make it happen but i don't know where mm. does it make sense doesn't make any sense maybe i should get go eat something i think my sugar intake was too low today so my brain is not functioning properly anyway all these rambling because i really just wanted this to be a very chilled vlog and i want to know actually about you once everything is over are you going back to your regular job Hello, my camera just died. I was in the middle of a sentence. I was about to ask you if what are your thoughts about all this situation? What do you want to do once everything is over? I mean, I told you what I are my plans, but what about yours? Are you going back to your regular job? You took this time as a sign from the universe, maybe? Not a blessing, also absolutely not a blessing. This is not worrying me. Just maybe something that made you, that made you rethink about your life i'm really curious actually first of all i'm always curious second thing i need someone else that i need someone to tell me not what to do but i want to hear others opinions because so i can make clear make my idea clearer in my mind i mean it's hard for everyone so hopefully engaging a conversation and inspiring a conversation would be beneficial for everyone and would make us feel less isolated 
Now, before my phone dies too, I will wrap this vlog up and I will see you soon. Bye-bye. Oh, subscribe if you want and hit the like button. Bye-bye. <laughs>